So now I'm starting in the helper part because technically I couldn't figure out exactly what I needed to do because there's spaces that they could be in one or more space. So I start to build that. Now, for instance, the squirrel fish could be right here. So I try to keep, I keep them in the same area and I drop in where they could be. This is not new techniques. And then you have your great, actually it's a whale shark, could be here or here. Your anatomy fish, ah, look at that, see, it could go right there. So, since I don't have a way to go in there directly, there is a way, but, I'm, but I can't right now show you that. But since it's so simple, why don't I just go back here and I drop this in like this. And of course, when you're at this point, you might as well look around because you're getting down to three spaces, three squares, and you can put these things in there. You see which ones aren't in there? Um, looks like the grouper's not in there, so it goes over here. And you get that one helper key, you start to see things a little bit differently. And so the only thing that's not in here now is, what do we got? We don't have the uh, that's the the whale shark so that goes there which then shows that this goes here so we can then with a little help you might as well come back here because you can see where things need to go or can go and this is an easy one the harder they are I mean they are hard I uh, I've gone sometimes a day without you without solving one. Um, of course, I'm not doing it 24 hours a day. See, they go there, so I could go back to my helper at that point and put one in right here, the little grouper right there or there, and it just starts to break down the block. And but it's also your thinking. So the whole idea of this is to see things in different ways in smaller ways and then the side of the block we're only on one side one side of the block so far time we're through with this we're gonna have six looks like right there so I go back to my block thing and I can move it from here to here then you gotta watch is if you lose an image and copy it over here so immediately hopefully you got enough images on there you'll go and put it back um we still don't know what's right here so we could go back to our helper and put in um, the one right here the one right here and then you start to see oh can it be an egg or a grouper and you look around up oh, and you see that well you got something right there and since we Cut it right there. We need to remove that. We cut it. And that's how you cut it. It's a right click, left click. Now we have one right here, so that should be simple. And that is this lionfish, which makes one right here. And that is the squirrel fish. And by the time you go back and look at your image setter again, you will have memorized a lot of different things. Now you can go directly like this, too, for the squirrel fish. And what are we missing here? We have both our sharks. Yeah, we're we'll missing a grouper. But the grouper, there, there, it's got a gun here. You gotta watch this, because I got a grouper covered here. But it could be here or here. So I can go back to the helper. Put a grouper into this position and into this position. Because it's really a subset of the block, ironically, until we know truly what the block is. We got one right there. And that one would be the lionfish. The lionfish in right there, which of course allows you to put the lionfish down here which also allows you to put the lionfish up here which allows you to put the lionfish down here so that helped um, 
We can make a game out of it. People that don't use helper can get maybe, you know, when you go in, you get double time on your helper, you know, something like that. We can set that up. Okay, so you got, you now know that these are right here. So you can go back to your helper and put in your anatomy fish in this case. And always try to get them in the same block so you don't have them. You need to, this also helps you organize your thoughts because you then realize that, hey, yeah, there's a position in life too. Um, we got one right there, you know, and sometimes I don't see it till I'm in the helper. And that one is the great white. The great white's in there now. And there's a great white there and a great white there, so a great white goes there. And we could have seen it from that one and that one also. And a great white there and a great white there, so a great white goes there. Now we're down to one spot. And it looks like this fish that comes in every shape. Something similar to that. And so you continue on to do it and go back and forth between your helper. And that's how you finish you know, do the game. If I can go a little faster, I will. But, um, for instance, this is a grouper. I have a grouper here and here. I have a, no groupers here, so I have a grouper here and here. Now, that's in this one. I also have could have a grouper down here, couldn't I? One, two. I could have a grouper here, here. No, I can't have one here because I got a grouper in there. So I can have one here and here. I can use that grouper. If I make a mistake like that, click on it, you can move it, and then it remember it's in the last place you move from, you can just hit delete. Or you can hit your your cut and copy with the right click, and um, it's a little boring at this point because a lot of it's just thinking through, and some people have done it quickly there. So anyhow, I will speed up this portion of the game from this point on. So I'm going to stop it and then have a speed up portion. Now, 